What's going on guys? It's JewDog1302 signing in again today. It's just a quick update before we start the video. This person right here who's been commenting on my videos, I'm going to have to disqualify you dude because my channel is not for children. So with that being said, on to the video. What's going on ladies and gentlemen? It's JewDog1302 signing in again today. I hope everybody's having a fabulous day because I am because today's Veterans Day and I wanted to put a little special video together just to say thank you to the veterans out there. You know if any of them watch my channel and the people serving our country if you guys do you know big shout out big thanks. Um, I guess um, I, I've never served. I'm not a veteran. I've never done that but I have eaten MREs before so with that being said Let's uh, open up some MREs and see what's in them. See what's in this one. Let's check it out. The earliest MREs in the 1900s up until 1938 were called reserve rations, which was water, one pound dehydrated meat or beef jerky and biscuit. But because of nutritional inadequacy, in 1938 it was replaced with this famous C ration. And that's the letter C, not C, where the fish live. <laughs> but with all joking aside, C rations consisted of pre-cooked canned foods that soldiers could uh, pretty much access anywhere when they were on the move if they needed to eat quick or fast the, the food was always fresh and nutritious and easy to cook then in 1975 the MRE was a thing that was in development and real quick the military figured out that this new thing was portable nutritious and then new things came awesome little goodies like M&M so soldiers could enjoy chocolates no matter the temperature and even Tabasco sauce and little stuff like that Then in the 1980s, 
the 1990s, the famous ration heater was invented. This thing allowed soldiers to cook their food a lot more simpler without having to make fires or whatever. I had used one to cook this chicken gumbo. I don't know if you saw it at the beginning of the video, but what it is, it's just a mixture of magnesium and other stuff and you add water and the specifications are it must eat a, heat a one eight ounce entree to 100 degrees Fahrenheit. You guys can see it is really good it was very good it was super hot it was very delicious it, it was tasted great i've never really had an original chicken gumbo so i can't compare it to one but this one was great i i really hope you guys uh, learned something from watching the video thank you for watching oh and i almost forgot you're the winner for the giveaway yep the, the two winners who were kind enough to send me photos of their prizes thank you guys i really appreciate it for participating and I'm very sorry I had to disqualify somebody because, like I said, this channel is not for children. This channel is for adults because I say a lot of bad words. So, with that being said, this has been Jew Dog 1302 signing out for today. Thank you guys. Have a wonderful day.